it was an exchange of documents that indicates our long-term relationship and its continuation for the future as well. As you know, we have been here cooperating with DEFTEC and serving Malaysian Armed Forces since year 2000. Started with uh, ACV Adnan contract first. The last contract we got over the past years was AV8 vehicle and it's coming to end. Of course, there are new opportunities in the country and we'll be looking for those together with DEFTEC again. It is about the requirement of the user. We are not suggesting any product that we already have in the inventory, but uh, it is rather what they need. So we have the capability of uh, tailoring the existing products to the customer's special needs. One of the examples would be hopefully the 4x4s you are seeing next to me. This is uh, originally a Turkish requirement, an anti-tank system. However, it can be used and very suitable for the reconnaissance missions too. And we know there will be a requirement in uh, uh, Malaysia in that uh, regard. We have been very active, as you know, uh, in Malaysia for long years. Uh, we extended that to Indonesia. It has been more than 10 years too, and it was we were awarded with a Harimau medium tank contract, as you know. And also we have business in Philippines, armored earth mover and uh, some uh, firepower capabilities. Contracts are already ongoing. So we are very active in the region. As our product portfolio extends, we have more customers interested in, in FNSS products. We are actively existing in South America recently. Of course, Turkic republics have always been under monitoring. Middle East is a very natural cooperation market for, for Turkish defense industries as well. Also, although I must say there are opportunities in Europe, mostly they own their own defense industries. To that end, we have limited markets in Europe, but uh, some of our special products like the Otter is receiving some interest as well from Western countries.